Hi, this is Charity and welcome back to the Prehistoric Werewolves Challenge, a challenge in The Sims 4 that I created and the rules for the challenge and a playlist for all the videos in the series will be in the description below. Now we do do death rolls in the series, like the Ultimate Decades Challenge and the History Challenge. So if you don't like doing death rolls, especially for children, babies, toddlers, and infants and pregnancies, then please don't watch this show as it might be triggering. So we're just with this one family that we actually had to restart from last time. So we have Cane Meadows and Sunny Meadows. They are the new werewolves and we actually have to find our way through the caves again. Sunny is actually doing that right now. Oh, and it's almost River's birthday. And yes, we did adopt out River. So she is part of the other collective family now. And this is a new CC tent. This is so adorable. The only problem with it is that you can't see the toddlers unless you're actually looking through this little hole when you're looking at it from this angle you can't even see them in there but this is the play tent from dream home decorator and it has the ability to let her learn her creative skills very quickly all right so we did find a potato and some prairie grass and we should probably go explore the tunnels oh i kind of forgot that i can't leave river over here by herself yeah, I guess I'll hire a nanny. And then what we're going to do is lock this for everyone. So he just can't interact with River. All right, because River is on her own. She's independent. She doesn't need anyone. I wish there was a mod out there that would allow toddlers and infants to be home alone without hiring a nanny. But the one that I had for toddlers doesn't work anymore. And it figures that the one skill she needs is communication. Great. Okay, I think we have all of the tunnel paths now, but not all of them on a single person. So we'll just use them to talk to each other and hopefully get all of the different paths. Okay, now he has everything. Okay, River's just working on her communication and then hopefully Sunny doesn't have to go to the bathroom anytime soon. Then Kane is working on reading his well. No, don't watch this guy. Read your werewolf book. I don't know why, but he didn't get credit for the last one. He did finish the Moonwood Mill history book. Okay, and Sunny has learned that she's pregnant. So she's going to go share the news with Kane. Okay, I think we have our first transformation. Sunny is going to become a werewolf. Oh, both of them at the same time. Oh, it's the full moon. Okay, well, that explains that. And of course, Sunny goes and destroys something. Great. I hate it when they do that. It was not in her queue, and I told her to go downstairs. Oh, Kane has completed his werewolf aspiration. So this is going to be the emissary of the collective family. Okay, so Sunny needs to read the werewolf books. Okay, it is River's birthday, but we are trying to get her up to level five communication. I'm going to hold off on actually having her birthday because having her as a low level child is better if she has the toddler skill that gives her a few more points for survival. Okay, finally level five and the communication skill. Happy birthday, River. Okay, so she's a top-notch toddler. And River is going to be evil? Really? No. Okay, she's going to be evil. Well, River, we all know how your villain origin story went. As a child, all of her parents and siblings died. So I guess that makes sense. Okay, we'll immediately tell her about the underground tunnels so that she can go back and forth as a child. Okay, now she just needs level five social skill and make a BFF. So we should try to befriend Christopher. I believe he's the leader of the Moonwood Mill Collective because both of my other families died. So it's definitely not one of them. 
Yeah, I can ask him to be a friend. No, don't, 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 don't be mean. It's going to be really hard to keep her in the good graces of the clan when she's mean. Okay, of her two parents, River is closest with her father. So I'm going to try and see if we can become best friends. Okay, how close do they have to be? Oh, that's right. It's under relationship. Okay, I'm going to forget that. Okay, now River has the best friend. And then she just needs to become friends with three other children. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Unless she meets some other kids from different families that are not part of my werewolf clans. And we are attacked by plasma bats. She's pregnant though. Oh, she did finish reading three werewolf books. And we're becoming an emissary of the collective. Oh, we're getting our first disaster. Okay, well, everybody wake up. What mood is everyone in? Of course... Sunny is very sad. Great. Okay, so it is actually fall now, not summer. I had to change that. And here we go. Oh, of course, we lose Sunny. So we have no more a possibility of children, even though her pregnancy survives. It can't survive if she doesn't survive. So, yeah, now we just have River and Kane living here. That's not good. So, despite my best efforts, sometimes you just get a bad roll because no matter how good your stats are and how many preventions you have against dying, there's always the possibility of getting zero out of a hundred. And a zero will kill you no matter what. And this time she got a one. Okay, Christopher happens to be hanging out over here. So we should try to get to know him since we need to take over the pack from him eventually. Oh, Kane is not going to be socially awkward anymore. He's going to be an insider. So that's a benefit. Okay, now we're a friend of the collective. Okay, now we can ask to join since we demonstrated scavenging, talked about Leonard Empathy, and gave him a rare un collectible or uncommon. If we can get this to work. Okay, and we took the first step in joining the Moonwood Mill Collective, but that actually might be a bad thing since it's really hard to keep up with them. I have to give him some werewolf gifts oh we have the good boy already let home oh, he disappeared okay so we have to try to be friendly with people in the moonwood mill collective which means give pack mate gifts why did you light that oh i guess it is cool but it's not cold i thought i had something to prevent them from lighting it when it wasn't cold well, we are going to put that out because I know it might start a fire. This is actually a CC fireplace, which is kind of cool because it looks like a normal fire. No, don't light it again. Come on. What is their obsession with lighting this? I might have to take it away if you keep doing that. No one is up here. Don't light that. Okay, so River spent the day cloud gazing with Christopher. And now we're going to become a friend of the Moonwood Mill Collective as a child. We can't join the pack because we're not officially a werewolf, but we can get a head start on it by being a friend. And then we're also friends with two adults. Okay, now how do we find some children? Okay, so this is the Space Explorer kind of setup, but it's a CC item. And the best part about this is that the leaves that come with it actually change with the season. Uh, but they're not exactly positioned just right. I thought they would be, but I guess it's all right. It's close enough. So gaining the motor skill will help River's chances for survival. I'm just going to focus on that right now. I don't know if we'll ever be able to find three other children. 
Now it does still have the effects like the bubbles and the smoke from the cannon. So that's not ideal, but it is what it is. Maybe I can try discussing expanding the family with Christopher. Well, I don't think you can do that as a child. You might have to be an adult. I know I have seen other children wandering around. But maybe I can try and get them to come over with the club system. Oh, wait, who is that? Not a child, though. That is... Col yeah, I can't say her name. Well, she's one of the mermaids, or at least she used to be a mermaid. But I don't think she is anymore because I changed her into a human. And you're an adult. Okay, I'm going to use the club system to make a children's club. Because unfortunately, the way it is, since River has no siblings, she most likely will never meet any other children. Oh, right, Jared. I completely forgot about Jared. Okay, so we've started a gathering. And now we can introduce ourselves to some of these people. Okay, it's getting kind of late. I didn't get to make friends very long, and I didn't make three friends yet, but we'll continue tomorrow. It's starting to get dark. Oh, is that an earthquake? It must be a volcanic bomb. Okay. Okay, so all we have to roll for is Kane Meadows and River Hernandez. And we have... Wow, that's disappointing. So not only does Kane die, but also River, she got a zero. I think she needed like maybe a nine in order to survive. Well, um, I unfortunately lost everyone in this household again. So since I lost everyone, I have to actually make new werewolves, which means back to the drawing board. Okay, this time I'm going to be a little bit more careful about getting them in the right mood for flirting because I don't want them to hate each other at first, and sometimes they do. And even though they reject each other, they sometimes still end up as faded mates, which I don't like, but that's just how it goes. Okay, someone already found... His faded mate, yes. Maddie and Mara are our couple. And usually three times is the charm. I can't figure out what is playful decor. There's something around here that is playful decor. Maybe it's a My Sims trophy? I don't see anything though. I have no idea what it is. Normally, I wouldn't bother with figuring out what it is, but having some kind of playful decor in the area is very, very bad because it makes people hysterical. I have no idea what it is. I don't have anything that actually has playful decor as something that should be in here. Hmm. Well... Maybe I'll just turn off environment effects because I don't really think that anything should be playful. Something is still making this playful. Okay, between the two of them, I managed to find my way through the underground tunnels. Although Mara did get hurt. So we're just trying to get some dinner. Okay, now they both know their way through the tunnels, so I'm going to have Maddie stay out here for a little bit and try to get some fish because he hasn't eaten yet, and we can cook something so that they both have something. Okay, we only need one fish for now. Okay, we have to do the beginner werewolf stuff again, which means reading books. And then we have to survive a full moon and level up to runt. But... Yeah, today is a full moon, so that should be fine. And we get our first disaster already with this family. It seems like the disasters tend to run like three a week, at least. Okay, so here we go. And of course, we lost the pregnancy.
but at least we didn't lose the female again because that would be just annoying. How? She's not even pregnant. Well, <laughs> I thought that she would be. She was acting like she was pregnant, but oh well. Okay, I'm trying to make friends with Christopher because, as you know, he is the leader. Okay, so we were able to make good enough friends with Christopher in order to get Maddie into the pack, but then he went away. Okay, that was the full moon. So I managed to lock them down here. Hopefully they both got transformation mastery. No, oh, of course, they neither one of them got it. Really? Okay, fine. All right, Mara's going to be neat. I cannot get them to finish any werewolf books. This is annoying sometimes. I don't know why, but it doesn't count as finished or they don't finish reading. They put it back and get another one because I've directed them to get another one. Okay, so Maddie finally finished his books. And he's going to be Emissary of the Collective. I don't know why, but our collective families are having more trouble than usual. Okay, so Mara's expecting there's going to be a new addition to the household. So she is eating for two. Okay, so we also got Mara to complete hers. Okay, we're trying to join the Moonwood Mill Collective. Um, Christopher wants to move in? Uh, I'm going to say yes, but technically, no, you can't move in, Christopher. We don't need bad sentiments with him, though. Okay, and there's our Saturday disaster. That happened while they were asleep. Okay, and so now we roll for the hopefully last disaster for this family. And everybody survives. Well, that's good luck. What? Maddie has not been feeling very romantic lately and is starting to feel kind of unflirty. Why is that? I don't see him failing. Maybe it's because he's being friendly with his wife, but unflirty doesn't really make sense right now, even though he has to be unflirty. Right now, they're just trying to make some friends because they need to socialize with four werewolf friends. And they also need to be a good werewolf ambassador. Okay. Mara is going to be romantically reserved instead of romantic. All right, sure. Okay, it's an awkward encounter. So maybe because those two were in a conversation with everyone else... They decided it wasn't a very romantic thing to do, but we're trying to hang out as a couple. I mean, you can't always be romantic. Well, one way to make sure you get transformation mastery is to trap yourself in a room and then start devouring a bunch of things. And what this does is it increases your fury by quite a lot so that you're definitely going to rampage and then you can immediately try to regain control. And even if it fails, you just stay in the room until you become yourself again. Okay, and we unlocked Transformation Mastery. Okay, so Maddie and Mara are going to be close now. Okay, so we got the four werewolf friends with Maddie. So this is the end of the week, and we're just working on our friendship with Jacob so that we can try to get another werewolf friend for Mara. And I'm going to be doing some pack giveaways October 4th through 6th, 2024. And I'm also going to be streaming on those days. So if you could please join the Discord server for details. More on that coming soon. This is Charity. Thanks for watching. Thank you.